Hi guys, welcome to today's video. Every time I pick up my phone, it starts beeping, like going off like crazy. Anyway, we are headed out. We're gonna go do some shopping. Girls are done school. Sam is home today because um, we have a holiday. We have like a, we have a government holiday here because of Remembrance Day yesterday. So we are all gonna go and have a family date. We're gonna go to the mall because it is the season. It is the season of shopping Ball. and eating at the mall. Day by day fan, it won't load because my phone has horrible internet connection out here. But um, so it's kind of Laura's riding journey. Yeah, I saw that this morning. Day by day fan, is that what it's called? Yeah. Yeah, she did a riding, a, Laura's riding a journey. Um, edit. Yeah, that's pretty neat. Though. Like a riding journey. Like it's only been a year for me, but I have a journey, you guys. That's so cool. Okay, so A and W now has paper straws. Which is really cool because saving our planet, right? See, you can even learn about things when you're eating out. Look at we found Hogwarts pajamas. Would you like those? No. We found Barbie like Barbie pajamas. Would you like Barbie no, pajamas? Sophia would like them. Came to the mall because last week I took Gabby shopping, and then Sophie's like, "I want a sweater," so we came to get her a new sweater. Yeah. No. Gabby wants more jeans now. Look at that, that's cute. No. I love this necklace. Levi would love this. Gabby and I love these. Sometimes you just need to take time out for retail shopping, retail therapy. There was a time where my girls got every single one of these Barbie horse things every single year. Every new one that came out, my kids wanted them. And now they just walk right past them when they switch from unicorns to dinosaurs. <laughs> yep. $400, that is like the cheapest looking unicorn I ever saw. But it's a rideable unicorn. If you get better, it's better up here. Who cares, it's the same as that. It's more money than that dinosaur. I'm with you, Gabby. I'm a dinosaur girl myself. I eat a Sophie's. But when Gabby was little, she was a don she was a unicorn girl. So I ended up getting this new coat for the barn. I love this color. This is Stacy have it. I have dark green eyes, and it kind of matches, like it kind. Of, this color kind of is my color. And yeah, all the girls in my family have this color coat. But anyway, the thing I like about it is that it's so puffy and so big. I can wear like this big huge sweater underneath it and I still feel comfy. And I love that because I like to be warm. Now Sam's gone in shopping to see if he can get a new coat. And I'm sitting here with Tweedledee and Tweedledum who's still eating her lunch. I'm oh. not dumb. <laughs> no, you're not dumb. That's just an expression. Here she is brave. I'm sitting here with Tweedledee and Tweedlebrave. <laughs> and they're playing on their phones while we do our shopping. I think that's how we're just going to have to do our shopping this year. Remember the other day I showed you guys what we do um, when you guys aren't there. We called Levi and he came running to us. Well, that's not really what we do. Um, we actually do that with our dogs as well at night upstairs in my bed. But it's hard for me to video it without an extra person here to help. So Sam's home and we're going to show you what happens when we do the same thing with our dogs. Okay, so um, we are all in our spots. Curtails Three of us. Oh, you have to put Ruby away maybe. Okay. Ruby. So, um, Sam's gonna put Macy down and, and we're gonna call her. Three, two, one. Come on, Macy! Come on, Macy! Come on! Right, three, two, one. Come on, Cookie! 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 All right, you guys. This is the test one. Little teeny tiny Toby. Three, we'll two, go. one. Come on, Toby! Come on! Come on! Come on, Toby! Come here! Come on. Oh, good he boy. Good boy. boy. He knows his mama. Isn't that amazing though? He knows me. He's Can we like, do Ruby? All right, let's do Ruby. Let's yes. do Ruby. Um, yes. Let's put Gabby and Dad together for Ruby. All right. Come on, Ruby. 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 Oh, yeah. Yes, you're my girl. Seems that. like everybody's dog goes to the right person. Yeah. They know who loves them. <laughs> 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 
Yeah. It might seem like super cheesy, but I swear to God, every night before we go to bed, when the girls are trying to procrastinate so they don't have to go to bed, we do that. We do that in our bed, and all of our dogs come to the right person. Like, they, they know. I love when we get to the barn, and we see in the field, and Storm's like, whoa. Look who's there. I wonder what they're thinking. I haven't they're all that. up there, standing there, and they're all looking at us. Are they thinking, oh, that's you. That's you, Storm. Your turn. Oh, that horse is blocking Storm. You guys can't see him. It's behind that, it's that red blanket. Make him come to you, Gabby. Hold the apple out. This girl is stubborn. Come, to, oh, here she comes. Look, where's the west she's looking for. Is? She's looking for grass. She's like ignoring us. Come on. Show her the apple. Where's the west? She's coming. Oh, the mud. So she does a lot better. See, she's got no friends in this field, so she'll come. Yeah, because she doesn't have friends. Yeah, and she doesn't seem as spicy, does she? Yesterday, she wouldn't even go in the barn for us. Today, she came. It's a good day to ride. And then we got Gabby over there, who's playing the waiting game. I'm like, don't you dare walk over to him. Pull up the apple. <laughs> Whistle! Aww, giving loves today. Aww, that's our Stella. Yeah, she's fluffy. She's loving today. We know what it's like to have a bad day, Stella. It's a camera. <laughs> she's like, you got more food? It's so funny because I was walking Stella and I wanted to walk her in because Sophie keeps saying that if she goes in the barn all by herself that she's like all afraid and and gets all worked up. So I walked her in and she was absolutely fine. So um, I think like a lot of all of our issues are our issues like our instructor tells us. She doesn't think anything's wrong with Stella. She thinks it's us. <laughs> Anyways, um, I was walking her to the, to the barn and she was like walking along beside me and like I said, she has always had impeccable ground manners. Like this horse does not ever push us. And slowly she was like leaning against me, leaning against me, so that after a few seconds, instead of going this way to the barn, we were going this way to the other field with her friends. <laughs> and she just stuck her head down to make grass. Yeah, and then she grabbed the grass. And then I said no. Look how she leans, leans slowly gets further away. Uh. <laughs> Horses are so sneaky, just like birds. Well, she tries to be gentle, but then she also wants something. Yeah, she is She gentle. doesn't like to pull with me, but then she's like, but I'm so scared I don't really need that. All right, Gabby, tell us what happened with the outfit today. Uh. When she woke up this morning, she didn't think she was riding today, so she just dressed for pleasure, not so that she matched her horse, and this is how she dressed. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah. All black. All black. Yeah. <laughs> and her horse is kind of like all black. <laughs> that was a coincidence. I didn't even plan to wear all black. Uh, I know. Like an all black outfit, but like. You're black, like a ninja. Black, 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 and black. Yeah, and so she ended up getting a storm. Sophia's saddle pad. Yeah, see, we're sisters. We share. So she got Sophia's saddle pad and. It's black with a little black. bit of blue. All right. I don't have a black saddle pad. Well, I do, just it's the one with the fluff. So I'm not going to wear that. A half pad? Oh. No, the fluffy one. Where yeah. I'm Remember way back when um, his saddle wasn't fitting very well and he got bumps on his back and we had to use uh, sheepskin and now he's good. Oh, and before I forget, I wanted to tell you guys some exciting stuff about our saddle fitter. She is coming on the 23rd, 23rd of December, the day before my birthday. We are gonna be, she's gonna be coming and a fitting storm for a saddle, finally. Yeah, but you're growing a lot. If they feel short, lower them. 
and jumping with them and it must have been Mom. good because you jumped great. Mom, watch. Okay. So. so, horse stretching 101. Horse stretching 101. We, we, have, we need to buy we some carrots. Stretches. Next okay. stretches. So we're finally getting into a rhythm now that it's winter and now that we're like more used to stuff. Um, she's one crazy in winter, but she's like not really crazy. Oh yeah, that's true. Winter is, but no, she's good today. Um, so here's the thing. One day we play with our horses and do stretches and all that kind of stuff. Um, so I got this look at my birthday and so it's literally dying. She's like, <laughs> give me all the... Stella. She's super inquisitive today. Stella, look what I have. Here. We have two lessons a week. Every week we play with our horses for one day, and one day we ride on the weekend um, with um, Kaylee. She's smart. Watch. Stella, look. Ste Stella, that's a whip. She's like, yeah, she does not like whips. Like it's moving. I hate it. Okay, now put it up there and show her. You should, you should play find the licket. I do not want you to work this right now. Okay, put it up and see what happens. Like, okay. Be patient now. Another thing I like about this Mom. barn is that they have a radio and it plays in here. So like, I always wanted to do that with Sabrina when she was in, uh, when she was spooky because I thought it would like muffle a lot of sounds for her. All right, so Sophie hid the licket. I don't know if you guys can see it. She's no, licking she's... my hand. She's like, ooh. <laughs> she's like, give me the licket. She got it. All right, Stella, go find the licket. Go find it. I told myself that maybe he ain't worth it. A lot of you guys are worried that Gabby brought jump storm too often. I know. How often do you jump storm? Not very often. I give them time to rest. Yeah, Gabby is like. So we're doing canticles. Gabby is a crazy person about resting. So mm -hmm. she jumps him two times a week. Now that we have maybe three. Yeah, now that we have two lessons a week, it might be three times a week, but usually it's two times a week. Normally it's two or three times, depending on how he feels. Yeah, and I can't I can just stand do this. coming and seeing these marks on him. It's him and Tick's get wrestling. Tex no, it's an old scab just picked. Yeah, it's an old scab and it came off, but ew, like I'm gonna have to clean it. I did. Oh, okay. That's why, it's That's why it looks like cleaned. I feel like Stella's having fun today. I feel like this is like fun for her. She's really uh, paying attention to her environment. She's really looking. She's looking for it. Done is fading me out. I just can't. She's like, I do not want to stretch this way. There we go. Wow, that's a good stretch. We need to get you a bag of carrots. We'll get... She looks like a baby calf right now, drinking a bottle. Guys, I'm feeding my baby calf. Right. Guys, she's getting ready for her lesson with our man instructor. She's like, let's do our man instructor trot. Gabby's really been working on getting fast.
can do it. There we go. Share my lipstick, taste my breath, and love me like you. Here, run to me, and then I'll give her a lick, and then I'll go find another spot, and she has to run to me to get a lick. This is the best trick. Your horse loves banana. I only have the banana. Yeah, because she doesn't really get too much of it from a couple of licks. Okay, this might not be professional, but we're trying to make it fun for her, right? Giving her a little reward every time. Yeah, like I feel like she's awake and alert. It's gonna be a long winter. We gotta make up some fun games. Storm's like, I'll get it. <laughs> he doesn't like it. Yay! Like, like, oh yes, this is the life. Trotting. You think she'd go faster though, don't? Wouldn't you? I have I to drag her the whole time. <laughs> I'm like I'm dragging her. I open it like I do under my tattoos. It's a remedy, remedy. She seems today. I know she's like, I don't care if I have to. Not crazy, act, act, not crazy like <laughs> yesterday. Just happy. to get exercise oh just to work out and fun to canter i think i already said this but yeah that's one thing you guys don't know is that gabby literally watches out for her horse above everybody else like she even questions her trainer sometimes if she thinks her trainer is asking him to do something that she thinks that he shouldn't be doing so i wanted him to realize oh wait every single time she rides me it's a mystery oh. am i doing oh Gabby's just telling me about how she wants it, him not to come to the arena expecting to jump all the time. She wants him to come not knowing what to expect so that it makes him want to come more. When Keeps I... him wanting to come. So one time she wants to come and do dressage and then maybe jump and then maybe play. Like she wants it to be a mystery all the time so he never gets into a rut. Yeah, same with Stella. Stella. Yeah, like it'd be so... <laughs> it'd be so amazing if we could do this for a full week. Just run around with her and play with this licket and then see what happens It'd be gone. with your bond. It's already an indent. Feel indent. I dare you to look it now. Ooh. Oh my god, that's disgusting. It tastes more like banana. It tastes more like banana. Let me try it. <laughs> she just licked it all fresh. Yeah, no, there's no way. It's like slimy. Did you guys see it? Ooh. Yeah. No. <laughs> Horse slobber. This that was that one gross. It just tastes like banana. Okay, now just turn around and walk away. Just don't even pay attention to her. It has a lick it. So, but, I mean, she has a lick it, not it. I know, but let's just see. 
She's like, it's not worth running for. I have been reading up on her fusing hawk and basically because it's the bottom part of her hawk, um, the prognosis is super good and she should be able to do everything again. Like she should have free movement and be able to do everything that a regular horse can do once it fuses. Here she goes. She's going to drop. I see it happening. Fire burning like I do under my tattoos. It's a remedy, remedy, remedy. Like everything broke. <laughs> oh, right over though. She's she grew all oh, that was so good. getting ready to take Stella back and Gabby was not finished yet and she's been working on teaching storm um, she's been working on lead changes lead changes before he forgets them yeah because the lead changes is a thing that you need for like hunter courses like if you do a jump and he swaps his lead you need to change it before the next jump or yeah so and he did it right i like he did the front one good so i all i did was oh, hear screaming good boy good boy and i was like oh gabby must have got her lead change it's something she really wants to work at so i bet you if you asked race car driver he will help you with it yeah okay so we decided we're gonna call our new coach because i don't want to spread his name around um, we're gonna call our new coach race car driver because race car driver is always saying pretend you're driving a race car And the girls are like I hate race cars <laughs> But he's a boy and that's what boys relate to so we're gonna call him race car driver Okay, so yeah. tomorrow morning we have our second lesson with race car driver. I'm excited it sounds so funny. The girls are excited I'm gonna work on lead changes and jumping yeah, so we got into the habit of like saying, okay, for my lesson this week, I'm gonna work on blah, blah, blah. And then we get here and our instructors are like, um, no, that's not what we're working on. <laughs> so we need to kind of figure that one out a bit.